This is the base plate that I use for all of my Lego things. This is the right one. It has been made with seven complete layers. Almost. That's because there are 21 squares on the seventh layer that I can fill up. That's because here, this part was able to be completely filled, but then the rest could not. Also, there are six complete layers, and it is made out of purely white blocks. Also, it was one of the biggest structures that I made, and it has a 12 by 12 base. The next one that I have created is this one. It has five different shades of blue, and three of them can be found in its very first layer. This was because I built this one from the start with dark blue, aqua blue, and normal blue on this side. Blue, light blue, can be found here on the second to last layer, along with, whoa, a glow blue can be found here too. And these are the ones with 12 by 12 bases. The next ones are gonna have 10 by 12 bases. And this is the red one. The red one should have had a 12 by 12 base. And it has eight complete layers. There's the ninth layer, which couldn't be completed. And here's what it is like. Anyways, this is made out of completely red. And what you might not have noticed is that there are some dark red blocks hidden inside, which I did not include. And I didn't want it to be distracting from the design. Next up is this one. Now, I actually need to change one of the bricks because I don't want any of that paint to be visible here. But that's okay. So it's now going to look like this. So it's a little messed up. But anyways, this one has a 10 by 12 base and is made out of mostly just the other bricks. There are some white, white, white leather bricks with the end of structure and I'm going to include a few of those like this green thing this one has green with 10 by 10 base and there are four shades of green here 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 and those two are at the top layer as well dark green has to be here normal and this is lighter anyways what we have next is this black structure it is pure black and it is a bit hard to build with just the black bricks so it's a bit hard to notice but here is what that looks like and I need to shine it like that so that you'll be able to see the details and anyways that finishes it off and this one it took me a while there was one thing which took me a long time to complete. And this one has seven complete layers, almost, because five squares are missing on the top one. This one has a six by 10 base, and there are two others that have this. The next one with a 10 base is this one. It has darker tan bricks at the top, and lighter ones near to the top. It also has this little brick at the bottom. The 2x10 brick, which is why it has to be like this. And the next one, wow, this one's our latest creation. And there are six complete layers, but there has to be three different shades of color for this one. Dark for the first layer, second one here, it's normal, and the third one, it's just brown. Our next structure is this. This structure is pure orange, however this bit is quite a little bit, because many of the bricks at the top have to be one by ones. There are eight complete layers on this. Almost. You see, there are a few more bricks that at the top, but I couldn't get the whole thing to finish. And finally, last but not least,
this six by six base. It has nine layers, and it's not only that, the only one with a flat top. Plus, it's the only one to have three colors in the top layer. The reason is because I didn't have a choice, and it might look a bit like Bali here, Barbie colors here. But here's what it looks like. There's purple all the way around the edge. And also, that there are no bricks bigger than a 2x4.